you like that like, they got hold it and then boom and most views take it off it got like over one it got like over it's like over 1k views on it so y'all might want to go check that out make sure like comment and subscribe if you have not seen that video make sure go check out that person so said everybody's experience is going to be different your experience could be different as well weird you know have like squares your little look of squares on your teeth and you don't want that What's up you guys, it's your girl Christina. As y'all can see, I'm currently in the doctor's office, so I really can't do my intro like that. Let me see if I get to the video. So I'm put y'all like right here. And what I got, I already got my color off. And if y'all haven't seen that, go check out my other's braces video. And y'all see how she did that. But um, y'all finna see how she puts them on. Because I didn't see that portion of it. So I gotta open my toothbrush. And I'm just gonna brush our teeth like right here. This is not my best part of it, y'all. It's like it just feels so good to brush your teeth after them braces because, like, I don't know where I'm. Yeah, I'm about to look. So. insurance you know got insurance and stuff your insurance will cover 
your dental. If your insurance does that, because not all insurance covers dental, just an FYI. But mine did, so I really don't gotta pay out of pocket. But once again, you gotta make sure you get enough money to cover the full amount. So if you don't get enough money to cover the full amount, then you gotta pay out of pocket for to pay for your bursary. You know what I'm saying? So just that for your information, so you will know. Next, after that, they're going to pretty much schedule your first day to get your braces on. So you will know the day. I got mine on February 28, 2020 of last year. So I got the fast braces. They're going to say you want fast braces or, you know, traditional braces. The difference between fast braces and traditional braces is that fast braces, the shape is more like triangular and got three prongs, you know, where they put the bands at. That's why I see like little triangles sometimes like on my teeth because it's the tra not traditional, it's the fast braces. Traditional got the four prongs where it's like the uh, um what you call it uh, um what's this what's this called? a square. So that's the difference. Plus, you know, fast braces is like six to nine months. So I'm most likely I probably gonna get my still taken off in January. Not sure, but I'll probably I bet, I bet y'all, y'all comment down below when y'all think I'm gonna get my braces taken off. But I'm thinking it's gonna be January. But it's gonna be any time between six to nine to 11 months, just depending on your teeth and how fast they're gonna shift. But I know my doctor was right, it's gonna be less than a year. So less than a year between three to nine months, maybe 11 months the most. That's what he told me. So, and once again, each orthodontist is different. I didn't really have to go to an orthodontist because my teeth wasn't shifted at that. My teeth was really pretty, actually, before I got braces. I just went to straighten up and close the gaps, which my dentist, the doctors there, could do that for me. So, I didn't really have to go to no orthodontist. Like I said, every person has a different experience. This is just my experience. Then, pretty much what they did was they had taken pressure on my teeth. So like, I had a bite onto this gooey, sticky stuff. This is disgusting. For the front, for the top, and the bottom. So the bottom, like, 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 like. And I hold it and it's that boom, take it off. And that was the pressures of my teeth for what I'm really not sure, probably for mine and for my retainers. But I'm not completely sure because my teeth are changing. So maybe it's like the before and after. I'm just not sure what that was for. They took a little like x-rays and stuff like that and then it's took pictures of my teeth too so they have before and they have after braces so pictures and stuff like that and then after that they pretty much laid me back and then my dentist came in the doctor the doctor dentist came in and he had one of his little employees there helping him with the tools and stuff like that so pretty much what they did was they put the glue on my teeth stuck it up there glue stuck stuck all the way around my teeth then the doctors came in, not doctors, the dentist came in, well the person that did my braces came in, and they pretty much just put the color around bands up there, and pretty much like that's it. And then they took some more pictures of my teeth. And that was it when I first got my braces. Then they pretty much went over some stuff that I couldn't eat. I'm gonna be real with y'all. I eat everything I want except for caramel and hard nuts. I still eat peanuts. like. Snicker bars, I still eat that, that got caramel in it, all that stuff that I'm not supposed to eat. But y'all, my, my brackets are not broke. <laughs> so, eh. and then I still eat chips, I still eat my life savers, I still eat gummy bears, I still eat all that stuff. Because honestly, my doctor said that you can eat it just in moderation. You know, it's not like an everyday, but you can eat it just in moderation, you know what I'm saying? And then pretty much they gave me like a bag of full of stuff. You want to go see what I got in that bag? Take a visit at this video. It'll pop over here. And it'll be in the little eye thing and in the description box down below. Something with braces. It got the most views. It got like over one. It got like over. It's like over 1K views. So. Y'all might want to go check that out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you have not seen that video, make sure you go check out that person's video and whatever. So that's pretty much what I got and stuff. I've got two brush, I got like a water floss, I got um, toothpaste. I just want to show y'all like what I got from the dentist appointment and whatever. So yeah. So you know, if you didn't know, my dentist. 
nice water pick. Yeah, like the little brushes. I put clean under my braces. Yeah, with the toothpaste, like gotta be careful. Do not be using a lot of toothpaste that got that whitening stuff in it because if it has the white stuff in it, it's gonna make like the, the you know where the squares are at? That can't really get brushed for real. That's why they take the brush up like that and like that, like boom, boom, and boom, boom, just to get, try to clean it and floss to get the plaque down. You know what I'm saying? So make sure y'all brush and floss every day, at least three times. I do two, but you're supposed to do three. Okay. And yeah, so like when you use the whitening, it's just gonna whiten what's shown. It's not gonna whiten under there. So just keep that in mind, not to have a lot of whitening stuff in there. Cause it's gonna, you know, look weird. You don't have like squares. You don't look at squares on your teeth. And you don't want that. <laughs> and then make sure you brush your teeth because you don't want food all stuck in your teeth and then you get um no, that's nasty. Okay. All right. And then uh, something else that I did experience when I was flossing is that my gums will bleed and it was swollen and very sensitive. So if you're if you're brushing or whatever and like it's sensitive and stuff, it's normal. They say it's just like I keep flossing there and it will, you know, relieve the pressure and stuff like that it's gonna bleed because food probably food that got stuck up in her and you didn't flush right away so that's why it's doing it pretty much you know what i'm saying and yeah so that's really all i have to say then each visit i had like doctor visits every two to three weeks every two to three weeks to get my color changed When I did the other doctor visit, that video will pop right here and also up here as well. Go check that out as well. You want to see how to take them off. You know what I'm saying? So they took it off pretty much, took the little bracket out and whatever. And then I put a new color. I got the little brush my teeth experience, you know, floss through all my good stuff. They came there and looked at my teeth. And then they, my dentist, dentist, like the head dentist, doctor dentist, I'm called doctor dentist. My doctor dentist told the other dentist to what basically what to do to my teeth. You know what I'm saying? Each visit, each visit. You know what I'm saying? So they did keep a good eye on my teeth, making sure everything was moving properly and making sure that everything was where they were supposed to go. Okay, okay. And that's pretty much it right now. And that's where I'm at right now, my journey right now. Um, like I said, everybody's experience is going to be different. Your experience could be different as well. So it just depends, you know what I'm saying? Um, braces is not as bad as everybody thinks. It doesn't hurt, you know, it don't hurt at all. It's just like, when you first get them, you're going to feel like you can't really eat, but you can really eat like it's normal. You know what I'm saying? Just got to eat soft stuff at first. And see your mouth get used to it. You gotta think about it. There's a lot of tension going on in your mouth. You know what I'm saying? So just take it slow. I promise you, you're gonna be able to eat within a week. You know? And yeah. So I mean, it's just soreness, pretty much. But as far as hurt or painful, no, it's not. It's not painful at all. If you want to bring some gum with you on each doctor visit, well, not really doctor visit. Well, if you can chew. If you like you chew, chew some sugar-free gum on your first, the first thing you get braces, they will help relieve some of the pain or you, like for me, I got hot pain problems, so it didn't really hurt for me. But other people say it hurts, and I was like, 
sometimes other people like my doctor business hurt too sometimes I don't but then again it's about different doctors so it just depends on your doctor it depends on you as a person and it just depends about everything for me and my experience it did not hurt it wasn't painful it really was just more of soreness you know what I'm saying on a sorting scale when I first got them it was a 10 because I couldn't eat I couldn't do nothing I was like I just hurt but as like that was after the fact during it was more like a zero but it did not hurt her. as far as hurtful hurting zero because it really hurt you know it was more of painful not painful but um soreness you know what I'm saying so that's pretty much it you guys that's all to braces um people really just be over exaggerating it like oh my god it's hurting it's this it's that it's no for me it won't and that's just that so yeah you guys so i hope i answered all you guys um, questions or anything that y'all was wondering if y'all want to see any more videos for me to do be sure to drop it down below in the comment section Please, please, please don't forget to be one of the first people to comment on my video to get your post notification shout out. You also have to be subscribed and have your bell on in order to get that shout out. You know what I'm saying? And I So make sure y'all push that thumbs up. Let's try to get this video up to 20 likes, you guys. And I will see you guys 